Um, my name is Barry Walfish. I specialize in history of biblical interpretation. And uh, I was especially, well, I did my doctorate on uh, the book of Esther and its uh, interpretation in Jewish uh, uh, texts in the Middle Ages. Well, as you know, Esther is a, uh, a book written in the diaspora, so in the Middle Ages especially, it was uh, seen as a model for uh, diaspora communities and uh, how to negotiate the, uh, the situation that they were in vis-a-vis um, -vis the uh, uh, authorities, the secular authorities, and uh, what to do in times when they're Jewish community was threatened and, uh, and how to uh, deal with that. Even now, uh, this, uh, Esther is seen as a, uh, as a model for uh, uh, salvation for God's uh, hidden work behind the scenes in uh, helping to save the Jewish people and also the, the role that uh, humans take in, uh, in uh, uh, engineering and uh, the uh, salvation of the people and in a way that uh, uh, could be a model for uh, leaders uh, in uh, any time. I developed an interest in how the Bible was used in uh, Judaism in different periods. And so, um, and EBR really uh, uh, fits into that uh, uh, interest of mine because it, the idea is to sh show how uh, the understanding of each biblical book has changed uh, over the centuries uh, and how much the uh, uh, communities or the uh, intellectual environment uh, has affected the understanding of the Bible. And, uh, and so uh, this is what we're trying to do in EBR. We're trying to trace the history of the uh, interpretation and reception of uh, biblical themes and concepts and books. In, all throughout the centuries and different periods and different uh, uh, locales. And so um, I find this a, a fascinating topic and one that is only now being uh, really uh, researched intensively. I find it a very uh, stimulating environment and uh, puts me in contact with colleagues from a variety of disciplines and uh, our meetings are very uh, uh, stimulating and interesting and, uh, and uh, quite fascinating.